You've got three degrees, 25 years of experience, understand your industry and have a unique way of working. So what? Hello and welcome to the Everyday Storyteller, a podcast for women with something to say. I'm your host, Hilary Salzman. Today I'm sharing one of my favourite marketing and storytelling hacks, the so what test. If your customers can quickly understand your value, aligned with the problem they're trying to solve, they are more likely to buy from you. Yet many businesses I see bury that value underneath a load of marketing fluff designed to make them look clever without ever thinking about their customer. With my foolproof method, you can put your customer value at the front and centre of every story you tell. So here's the trick. With every statement you make, everything you write, keep asking, so what does this actually mean for my customer? Take my business, for example. I could say I write stories for small businesses. So what? Okay, I help businesses use storytelling techniques to market themselves better. Yes, okay, but so what? I help businesses use storytelling to attract new customers and create deeper connections. Okay, we're getting somewhere now, but what does that actually mean? How about this? Grow a successful, sustainable brand that exceeds your ambitions by learning to embrace your inner storyteller. Boom, there it is. The point in which you can't ask so what anymore because you've already answered it in your statement. The value of what I do is clear, business growth, sustainable success, and you know exactly what I would do to help you achieve it. Your customers' minds are hectic and busy. Showing the value to them up front will at the very least catch their attention, allowing you to tell them more about what you do and what they would get if they invest in you. So next time you write something or look at how you talk about your products or services, Just have it in the back of your mind or in massive blooming letters on a post-it note in front of you. So what? If you've enjoyed this podcast, please do leave a five-star rating or review. This really helps other women discover the show so they can learn how to make their voices matter too.